Hey y'all, hey, it is Sharina, XOXO Sharina on the social. If you are new here, girl, hey, if you are subscribed, hey, girl, hey. In this video, I will be preparing a few drinks to give you some ideas of what to do for Galentine. Or in case you just want to make yourself a cute drink and relax and chill at home alone this Valentine's Day. These are alcoholic beverages, so if you are not over the age of 21, this video is not for you. Come back when you turn 21. For those that are over 21, please always remember to drink responsibly. So look y'all, this is most definitely the tequila edition. Had some tequila, had to kind of make it stretch for, these, for this video, but... I want to put together some drinks to give y'all some ideas. So first drink up would of course be a strawberry margarita because what girl doesn't like a strawberry margarita? It's okay, you might just like the original margarita. So all you'll need is margarita mix and tequila. That's the easiest way to make it simple without all the mixing together grab you margarita mix actually when i was at the store they had strawberry mango and the original pick up whatever margarita mix that you're feeling you know in the mood for grab you some tequila make sure you have a lime and some sugar or salt for the rim and that's all you need to mix up this drink baby you don't know what you do to me between me and you i feel like chemistry Here's a quick little tip for the rim since you already have your lime right once you cut and slice your lime squeeze a little bit of juice on the saucer take your cup go around and boom now it's wet so you can dip it in your salt or sugar I'm a sugar rim type of girl so I put sugar around my rim instead of using like water I prefer to use the lime juice just to give your rim just like a little bit of a zest if you're like me, you like to take your drinks to the next level, I have light cubes that I got from Amazon. I'll try to make sure to link them below. And they are light cubes. They're not ice cubes. They're literally just for looks. And they're activated by water. So as soon as you put them in the drink, they light up and make your drink cute. Just to give your margarita, you know, like a cute little extra vibe to it. Number two. Drink two is the tequila and lemonade drink. Now it's that simple. Lemonade, tequila. You can mix it up how you want to do. You know, go a little while and do half and half. Do about four ounces of tequila and then fill the rest up with lemonade. That's typically what they do at the bar anyway. Four ounces is your shot size. So you can just get you a cup lemonade tequila mix it in there now here's the thing it is on you if you want to mix this drink up i prefer to just have my drinks mixed because i like the flavors to always blend but that's on you you can pour the tequila 
and pour the lemonade however you want. Or you can put them in a shaker and shake them up to get those flavors to blend. If you wanna just add a little bit of triple sec liqueur, you can do that as well. That's just a mixer, it helps all the flavors to blend. So it's always something good to just have on hand. Now, if you wanna take this drink up a notch, edible glitter. So what I did is I took edible glitter, put an ice cube in there, rolled it around, and drop that baby right on in the drink. It makes your drink shimmer. It doesn't really, I was sipping on it and I didn't really see like glitter in my mouth so it wasn't like a weird situation. But it is something that's cute that you can just take your drink to the next level. And if you're a host and you like to woo and eye folks, that's something that will definitely get the girls talking. <laughs> Drink three is for the martini lovers. So if you're a martini girl, this envy cocktail might be something that you like. It's tequila, pineapple juice, and curacao, you know, the blue liqueur mix those three in there once again you can decide if you want to shake it up or not put that right into your martini glass and it gives like this green like it says in the cocktail so it's a green color if you want to just pop something cute in there just to have a garnish i would definitely say to add a cherry when in doubt throw a cherry in the cup then dip me underway. Drink four is for more of the chill, laid back type girls. A tequila soda. So it's tequila, lime juice, and club soda. Now, me personally, I prefer to add a little lemonade with this drink because I'm I, as much as I love lime, I'm not in love with lime. So to make it like a just kind of citrusy kind of drink, I added lemonade and lime juice with the tequila and then added that club soda. And when I say it's very citrus and refreshing, that's exactly what it tastes like. First, since you still have a lime, make sure you cut a little garnish, pop it in that cup and serve it chilled. and last drink is definitely for the party girls so there's some girls that like to sip on a cute little drink there's some that like to get right to the point this one is definitely for y'all it's simply a tequila shot now i know you could just pour tequila in a shot glass and say take it to the head or you can take that lime juice whirl that shot glass around the lime juice put it in salt or sugar once again that's definitely your choice with a shot i kind of think salt helps you out a little better with that shot but once again it's on you whatever you want to put around your rim you're drinking it you do what you want
These drinks are not necessarily the hardest drinks to make. So once you watch my video and I'll leave the actual recipes below in the description box, you should have no problem making these when you have a few folks over. I already had my table made, so I just changed up the centerpiece so that I can have the drinks out. What I like about the centerpiece is you can definitely have fun with it. You get a regular cake stand, you can get the layered cake stand, and instead of having desserts, you can put your drinks on it, or you can just have a regular centerpiece. Get a wooden board. Now my board is really for charcuterie, so it's more of a uh, rectangle charcuterie board which wouldn't look that cute on my table. So what I did is I took some tissue paper and I taped it. So what I did is I took the wooden board and I took tissue paper and then I just wrapped it around and taped it in the back. And this made my centerpiece. This is honestly the time to decorate your table, get it cute, have some candles, some lights, and just have fun with it. Now let me know below how do you like these drinks. And if you have any other drink faves that that's tequila, drop it below and let me know. I would love to make that and try it as well. Thank you so much for watching and I will see y'all in the next video.